During the handover, Ambassador Lisa Johnson said, wildlife crime poses a critical threat to economic development and undermines security. The U.S. government, she said, supports Namibia's efforts at protecting its wildlife. The U.S. runs projects in Namibia valued at about $300 million dedicated to conservation and the combating of wildlife crime in the country. We're committed to continuing to support the government of Namibia's own anti-poaching efforts and wildlife crime. Those who are doing the poaching and wildlife trafficking um, are really fueling a lucrative criminal industry around the world. And that's to the detriment of Namibia and, and all nations that uh, have these iconic species. So that's why we are continuing to support the ministry's efforts. The Minister of Environment and Tourism, Pohamba Shifeta, received the donation. With this kind of support, the Ministry of Environment and Tourism is motivated to work hard to address wildlife crimes. I reiterate our call to the public to remain vigilant and reject any form of wildlife crime. I want to warn those involved in, the, in these types, types of um, crime that the Ministry of Environment and Tourism and its um, partners uh, um, in law enforcement agencies have the capacity to catch them. The donation includes four vehicles, GPS receivers, camping equipment and support in crime-fighting investigation techniques for the Waterberg Law Enforcement School. At present, 65 pairs of binoculars have been handed over, while other equipment is expected to arrive via shipment at intervals. Julana Fuka, NBC News, Ventuk.